Hey guys, it's Ison here, and we are here with the Spelunky Daily. Uh, yesterday I did terrible. I really don't even want to talk about it. Uh, it was real bad. But today, I feel like we can do better. Let's jump on into it. Um, it's been an interesting day. Just found out I have a imposter account on Twitter. That was weird. Icy New Year O. It's a really confusing one, because like they didn't tweet anything malicious. They just kind of like promoted a few people and like <sighs> so odd. Like, I'm still like confused by the whole situation. Cause it's just weird. Like I can't even get over how weird this was. Cause they took like my exact picture. I mean hell, they even linked to my YouTube. It was weird. But yeah, this is probably a good time to promote it though. If you haven't followed my uh, Twitter, you should check it out. Twitter.com slash Icy New Year. I really want to get up there. Um, but it's going to take me a couple bombs. So I think I'm probably going to not. Like, there's a crate up there I really want. But I think instead we're just going to cut our losses, hold on to our bombs for now, and just roll with it. So here we go. And let's see what happens. Okay. No extra maiden on that floor, but we didn't use any resources. Didn't really lose anything, so I'm feeling okay. As long as the, um, like, Ujet Eye is in a decent place, I'm feeling pretty good. Got sticky bombs, which is nice. What's up here? I'm really hoping the Ujet Eye isn't up there, because I'm kind of just not going for it. Um, I'm pretty sure it isn't. Like, it just doesn't feel right. I, I Just based on the layout, I highly doubt both the key and the chest are up there. Um, if I happen to find one or the other, I'll know, you know, maybe I'll find out I was wrong. Let's see what we have here. We're definitely robbing that shop blind. Because it's full of awesome. So, that's on the agenda. Uh, two bomb boxes on the second level. Uh, I literally can't say no to that. Like, it would be physically impossible for me to say no. Uh, I did just make it so I have to use a rope, which is kind of crap, but whatever. For two bomb boxes... I will use a rope. We got the life. And, uh, got a camera. Obviously, not that interested in the camera. I am interested in going over here, though, since we have redonkulous amounts of, uh, bombs. Grab us some more gold. Some more gem rolls. And another gem rolled. So, not bad. We'll start ghosting here soon. Like, once we find a vault, we'll start ghosting like crazy. Um, my only concern is not checking up near the top there. I really hope I didn't miss the Ujedi, but I'm pretty certain I didn't. Okay, cool. Immediately got a gem rolled. That's nice. Uh, another crate. Kind of wish that the maiden hadn't been so early on. I hate when they've got early maidens and I pissed off shopkeeps. It just makes me feel like I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get her. I want to drop the shotgun. Okay, let's we'll, we'll toss her down. Whip her in the face. We're going to go ahead and toss her down. Um, and basically let her kind of do her thing. Hope like heck she makes it to the end. But if she doesn't, I'm not going to fret too much over it. Very nice that we get to immediately see that we did not miss the Ujedi. Very happy about that. Where is the key, though? That is the million Ujedi question. Um, let's go ahead and make that happen. Deal with this man in a gun manner. Okay, cool. The key. Fantastic. Very, very excited that the key was super easy to get to. That made me happy. Extra thousand gold. No one's complaining. Except those people below me in the leaderboards. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm going to stop being cocky because it's going to kick me in the ass. And let's, uh, hey, Maiden's alive. I'm feeling like there isn't a shop on this floor. If there is, it's got to be, like, down here in the bottom right corner, essentially. There's no shop. Kind of mixed feelings on that. I mean, it obviously makes my life a little easier. Not having to deal with an extra shopkeeper. But it is a lot less resources. Because I could be getting some real good stuff out of that shop. So that's a little sad. Take care of that. We're going to leave the Maiden here for now, and we're just going to fire some shots this way. I don't know how if it was a clear enough path to hit the shopkeep. It uh, doesn't feel like it is, but maybe I'll be able to, like, get him from here. 
Maybe. There we go. That is what I was hoping for. Kind of dangerous here. Not excited about this. If a couple bombs can make my life easier, worth it. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, so equipment-wise, we're actually really low. We've got, like, nothing good. Uh, Money-wise, we're doing okay. We do have the Ujedi, which is a huge bonus. Um, any good locations for bombs here? I kind of want to hold on to my bombs. Yeah, we'll just hold on to the bombs for now. I don't want to start, like, ghosting individual gems this early. Um... Okay, so an idol on this floor. We'll go ahead and use a rope here. Boom. Okay, extra ruby. Very nice. More bombs. A rope for three more bombs. Not a bad deal. Um, I'm hoping for a shop on this floor. As long as it's a shop that's not in, like, a ridiculously annoying position. That was scary and dumb. Like, there was no benefit to killing that guy. That, uh, bat guy. But I did it anyway. Okay, so we have the Maiden up here. I'm at five lives. So I don't think I'm going to burn the rope for the Maiden. The Idol. It's going to cost me a couple ropes to get to. Okay. But I probably am going to go up there to get that Vault. I do... Like, it all depends. Very much depends. Oh, thank God. That was, uh, real convenient. The way he got caught in all those spider webs. I'm a lucky man. Okay, so what we got over here? No shop. I mean, real... Oh, that was a bad placement. I could have gotten that extra gold, but I didn't. Now here's the thing. Four ropes. I think it'd be almost immoral for me not to do this. Especially because he he'll probably just kill himself on that. Like, there's a high chance he's going to kill himself. There we go. That is the... Thing I was hoping for. We're gonna go ahead and blow this open just to make our life a little easier. Uh, and I think I can make the ghost get that. I really do. Let's see. What we're gonna do is run this way. Yeah, the rope's in the right position. Cool. Well, yeah, we can make this happen. We can ghost that vault. We have to have the ghost come up here. Like, this is important, and we gotta be very quick about this. Ghost in that vault's gonna be so much more than the idol, so I'm not even gonna bother with the idol. Or we can blow through the back of that. Eh, uh, you know what? Actually, if I can make the ghost come from the other direction, that might be easier. Yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna try to get the ghost to come from the other direction. I think he will. I think we're far enough in. We can make that happen. So, at this point, we just sit and wait, and I apologize for that. Let's, uh, let's kind of plan our strategy here. I really hope he's coming from the right direction. I'm not certain of it now. If he's coming from behind me, oh, thank God. So to say, if he's coming from behind me, this could be pretty terrible. Okay, so let's sit about here. What I want to do is jump up here, jump over here. Whoa, that was real dumb. Grab that. Okay, oh my God, I'm like crapping my pants right now. That was terrifying. And let's get the hell out. Oh, I came way too close to him far too many times. Hoo -hoo -hoo -hoo. And here we are. We're in the jungle, baby. And there is my one freeze for the day. Or for the recording. Luckily, it was a nice mini freeze. Uh, I still have no equipment. But hopefully that will change the black market. Uh, nothing over there. Almost missed that 625 gold. Don't want to do that. Okay, looking pretty good so far. Jump on this man's head just to teach him who's boss. We got a compass. Moving up in the world. There we are. Okay, we're going to poke our heads down here. <laughs> that was the most brutal way to kill that caveman. Okay, so there's an altar. I'm going to want to go down there. But first, we're just going to poke around the sides real quick. Look for any extra money. Oh, I thought that was going to sacrifice. Okay, he's going to be fine down there. I really thought that was going to sacrifice that man. That would have been amazing. 
Okay, so we're gonna start off real careful here, because I don't know where the shopkeeper is. There we go, got spring shoes. Obviously not my first choice, but not a bad thing. Okay, cool. Shopkeeper is kind of tucked away over there. Pretty comfortably. Let's get this mi- No. I don't need you, mini frog. Ow, oh, walked right into that one. Okay, so... I'm very uncomfortable with the number of ropes I have. I think I might just bomb through here. Oh, crap. This might make life easier anyway. Excellent. That uh, worked out real well. Did you seriously just eat my corpse? Okay. So I'm fairly certain the black market isn't on this floor, so let's keep on going. Like, not 100%. There's like a tiny possibility I missed it, but I'm 99% sure. Oh, crap. That was bad. I really thought I could make that jump. I was sorely mistaken. Well, that'll take care of the tiki trap problem. Or not. Tiki trap kind of just protected itself there. Okay. I don't have the right shoes for this. I do have the right bombs for this, though. Hopefully this man will kill himself. Good possibility of it. Okay, cool. So now there's either a vault... Or a shop. And there is a black market. Okay. Where is it? That rapscallion stole a bomb from me. I barely even noticed. I thought he had stolen gold. Okay, so... We have to go up there. Like, this has to happen. It is a vault. Okay. I hear the maiden. Where's my... I saw it blink. I just don't know where. It was blinking when I was, like, over here, wasn't it? Is it, like, up in this corner? Hmm. Now I'm just confused. Okay, we're not gonna ghost this. So I really need to figure this out. Let's take a peek up here. I have one rope left, which worries me immensely. Man, that would be a pain to get to if you weren't killing shopkeeps. Holy crap. It would be a huge pain in the butt. Uh, and we're going to head on out. I could bomb upwards and then rope to get that crate and uh, the dog. I should have. I was about to make an excuse as to why like I didn't want to do that. I guess, like... I wouldn't have my rope to do my trickery here, which is kind of an issue. It gets a little bit harder when you can't just hide up here with a rope. But, um... I don't know. In the black market, I'm not too terribly worried about what that crate could have contained. I feel like I can probably get some good stuff here. Um, yep. So far, so good. We have down here some more bombs. Maiden is dead. One less thing to worry about. Okay, that shopkeeper has died somehow. Uh, spike shoes. Nice. I think I already had them, but I'm not positive. Okay, we are running low on bombs, which is a concern. Seems like most of the shopkeepers have killed themselves, which is awesome. I wish I like was better at dealing with this guy without using bombs. There we go. That was a good, at least an efficient bomb. And then I take the dumbest damage the world has ever seen. Grab their gold. And let's see, more gold up here. Okay, there is a shopkeeper left over there. I wasn't sure if there was. Fire shots, fire shots. We're good. And what are we gonna do about this man? I don't really have the bombs to, like, be able to just bomb downwards like I normally would. So, maybe we can just kind of bypass him. Oh, I'm real low on health, which is scary. Luckily, that shopkeeper has died. We're going to go ahead and bomb there. Hope, like hell, the shopkeeper doesn't come after us. And I'm in a really precarious position. At one life, I have to make it 
out of the jungle and into the ice caves. And at least to the second level of the ice caves, if the game's nice to me. So I gotta be real careful. Oh god, almost died right there. Not a good scene, to say the least. And we don't have many bombs. Like, that's a pretty big concern. I used far too many bombs in that black market. Uh, dropping my shotgun is not the best way to start off this situation. Killing that man is. Excellent, excellent. Any amount of bombs I can get would be phenomenal. Um, where'd that... This frog is gonna mess with me, isn't he? Let's take care of this frog. Okay, I was real afraid he was gonna make it up here. Now I'm just really hoping... Come on. There we go, we'll just leave. Screw it, let's just leave. Don't need to kill the man, we're just we're just out. So I don't have a cape. I don't have a jetpack. Um pretty low in health. As long as I can make it to like the uh As long as I can make it to the Moa statue, everything's okay. Like that's we get we get a pass. It's just whether or not we can do that. I have the compass, which makes life a lot easier. Because getting stuck around here without knowing where you're supposed to go is hell. Oh, that scared me. I don't like being in a position where even fall damage can kill me. That was the worst bomb of all time. That was the best bomb of all time. Jump on that man's head, and we are just leaving. Okay, so I'm really hoping the Moa statue's on this level. If it's on this level, I'm going to feel a lot more comfortable because I know I can freely die. Um, and there is something I wanted to try. I've heard it told in Legends that uh, if you die by freezing, you get to keep your gun. Oh, God! That was... Not cool, game. Not cool. Come here, Gemerald. Okay, there's nothing of value up there. But there is a gem world here. I'm not going to bother with the maiden. Simply because I have to die anyway. And trying to get both the maiden and my shotgun to the exit is going to be hellish. I have to make as much horizontal movement as possible. So I can see if the Moa statue is on the level. Let's pop down here. What is this guy doing? Look at this shenanigans. Wow. He died. Uh, so there's a vault or a shop in this level. Probably a vault. There's not normally shops on the uh, ice caves. Ah, uh, yep. It's a vault. Which I'd love to uh, partake in, but I don't have many bombs, so I'm not going to. Okay. Moving on. No Moa statue. Hopefully we didn't miss it. It's got to be on this level or the next. There's the Moa statue. I love it when you can see it from the entrance. It just immediately makes you feel better. So I'd like to get a um, maiden to the exit if I can. That would be huge. Uh, I'd like to get all the bombs in the world. I'd like to get a jetpack. I'd like to be a little bit taller. I'd like to be a baller. I uh, wish I had a girl because I'd call her. And, um, yeah, some other... Well, it's okay. We had to die on that level. I prefer not to die stupidly like that, but we had to die... At least we're cool and on fire. So, yeah. Moving on. I did not get to test my, uh... The legends about, uh... The way to keep the jetpack. Ever since I heard that, I've yet to have a single opportunity to test it. Okay, I had one opportunity, but then I accidentally killed the guy who had the, uh... I killed the mammoth. Oh my god, that was terrifying. What is wrong with me? I... am really bad at picking stuff up, apparently. Let's drop her off. Ah. Well, never mind. She's dead. Um... Sorry. 
Let's see. There's a man down here. I missed. I don't even know what I was trying to do with that. Okay, that was just the wrong way. Can I get this Yeti's corpse? And toss it at this man. Yeah! So I'm super excited I got a shotgun. Like, that makes my life happy. Okay. Um, I think I'm just gonna get this uh, sapphire up here and then leave before this freaking alien destroys my entire platform there. We're doing well. Uh, it's been a long time since I've gotten to the temple. Okay, that's a real convenient place for Anubis. We'll just kill him. That was super easy. Bad Anubis balls. Get out of here. Scat. Okay, I'm still real low on um, bombs, which worries me very much. Okay. That thwomp. Um, scared the ever-living hell out of me. I don't know why it didn't kill me. Get out of here, fireball. No one loves you. Ugh. Come on, hurry before the fireballs come. Got him. Okay, there's a thwomp there. Oh, okay. Not excited about that thwompage. There we go. Run, run, run. Kill the mummy. That was so dangerous. That could have just popped back and killed me. Real glad it found a corpse it liked. That was scary. I'm playing a dangerous game. The most dangerous game. Oh, God. That was a... Ugh. Please just stay over there, Psychic Bolt. These thwomps, man. Why did I think that might be worth it? Okay, moving on. Whew. Six bombs, three ropes. We might go to the City of Gold. Okay, something pissed off the shopkeeper. This is worth a bomb. I hope. It's gonna be another parachute, isn't it? It is spike shoes. That is just as bad as another parachute at this point. Okay, I need to not piss this guy off. That's important. I'd also like to find the exit before I go to the City of Gold there. Because I'd like to have a shotgun in the City of Gold. That'll save me, like, two bombs. Which is kind of a big deal right now. Oh, God! Get out of here! Um... I have the ropes to get back. Okay, I just want to make sure. Because like, I, I, I jumped down without even thinking about if I had the ropes to get back. And that would have been the most heartbreaking thing ever. Okay. We'll drop a rope here. Just so we can shoot this man. Cool, he's dead. So let's go... Oh god, no. No fire, no fire. Big money, big money, no whammy, no whammy. Stop. Okay. Now we're gonna, get our, gonna go get our shotgun and our grasp of the English language. We left them both at the exit. And there we go. Let's go ahead and take this. I'm really hoping the ghost doesn't come. Oh! I'm scum. I'm the worst scum that ever scummed. But, um, yeah. I'm currently in rank 11. Not a bad score, honestly. <clears throat> I want to thank you all for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and as always... Have a great day.